I'm Layla. Today's video, we're going to chat all about new player login rewards, particularly High Katoon, and why she's an amazing starter champ. She is not a chicken, so let's go talk about her. Okay, if you guys didn't know, you get different login rewards for champs as you play the game. And on day 30, you get High Katoon. She's an epic support barbarian spirit affinity, and she's a good champ. There are quite a few champs that we get that are pretty good and you want to keep around and High Katoon is definitely one of them and she's such a really really good one that you get early in the game and we'll talk about why. One of the biggest and nice things about her is that she does increases ally speed in all battles by 19%. This can be really helpful in the beginning with arena and also with your dungeons. So she already is a really nice speed lead that you get early in the game. Her A1 is called Imperial Grace, attacks an enemy, has a 25% chance of placing a 30% decrease speed. Her Rally the Horde is fills the turn meter of all allies by 15% and places a 30% increased speed in all allies for two turns. And that works really nice with the speed aura as well. So this is great. Again, considering you get her 30 days into the game, Already, you can toss her as your speed lead in Arena and then she can pretty much boost your team immediately. With her speed aura of 19 plus, she does a 30% increased speed buff on allies for two turns. Also, her Shamanic Lightning attacks all enemies, has a 50% chance of decreasing the turn meter by 15%. So the question comes up sometimes when people are first starting and they're told, you know, level up your champs as fast as you can, sacrifice everything. She's not a chicken. She's definitely not a chicken, guys. She's probably one of the best that I would think who helped me out in particular. She's one of the best login ones you can get. And the fact that you can get her 30 days into the game can be so useful, especially if you're free to play. She's great. Yeah, and I see people saying that she's like a Lissandra. She's like a budgeted Lissandra. And there's so many different uses for her. So she's definitely not a chicken. Not a chicken early on at all. You might get to the point where you end up getting some faster and some better boosters and some speed leads. But you know, let's be honest, that does take some time. Like if you're trying to get Arbiter, if you're doing the Arbiter missions, it's gonna take a while unless you get lucky and pull her from a shard, or if you end up pulling other really good ones from shards. But this one, she's a guaranteed champ that you will get as long as you log in every single day and grab your logins. So keep in mind, remember, she's not a chicken. She's useful. She's definitely useful early on and you might even use her for a little while afterwards. And I know this one comes up often. I'm not really sure why. And I think what gets hard too about this game, you still use her exactly, you do still use her. And the thing was I was using her until I pulled Arbiter. When I got Arbiter like two months in, then I switched. But like I said, I pulled Arbiter. And even when I did that, I kept her as a lead in my Arena 3v3. We're just chatting about High Katoon because this question kind of comes up a lot. Is about High Katoon. Because we talk about, we talk about login champs, we talk about getting rid of them. See, Liaris uses her for faction wars and uses her on Scarab King. And same thing is even though right now I have, I have two Arbiters, I have, you know, I got Prince Kaimar, so I have really nice other speed leads. Oh, I have Lord Sharzar as well, but I still use her. I use her myself still in Faction Wars as well too. So she definitely has her place. Now, again, depending on your account, everyone's account is different, but she's very much not a chicken, especially early game. So don't make the mistake of getting her and then feeding her off to your starter. Don't do that. Which is why I'm also talking about this because there's been people that have done that and then they regretted it afterwards when they realized how good she was, okay? So don't get her 30 days in and then feed her to your starter champ. Don't, don't do that, don't. You have two Lissandras and you still use her. Yeah, she's good. Yeah, she's really good for a speed boost. She's good for classic and tag team Anina. Yeah, and again, there's people who still use her. Absolutely, absolutely. But, and I, I also understand too that when you first start the game, it is really hard trying to figure that out. 